The realistic styles in Showcase are so named because they're designed to render your model in the most realistic manner possible. The default render style is the both shadow style. This refers to the fact that both environment and ambient shadows are rendered in this style. As you can see, the result is quite realistic. Open the Visual Styles Library by using the keyboard shortcut V. Zoom out for a better view of the car when the Visual Style Library opens. You can set your preferred view as the Home view by right-clicking on the View Cube and selecting Set Current View as Home from the menu. As you can see, there are five different styles in the Realistic category. No Shadows, Ambient Shadows, Shadows, Both Shadows, and Ray Tracing. Note that both shadows and ray tracing are the only two styles that have keyboard shortcuts as indicated by the letters D and R on their respective icons. These styles can be activated at any time by using these shortcuts. Click the No Shadows icon to activate the No Shadows visual style and note the changes in the screen image. The car now looks less realistic, but its form and color are maintained. Click the Adjust Lighting tool on the main task user interface. When the Adjust Lighting window opens, move the light and see that changes in lighting can still be seen and, in fact, still have a dramatic effect on the screen image. Close the Adjust Lighting tool window as it will not allow changes to be made to the visual style while it's active. Now, activate the Ambient Shadows visual style and reactivate the Adjust Lighting tool. As you move the light around in the model, notice that there are no shadows being cast on the ground beneath the car. Close the Adjust Lighting tool, activate the Shadows Visual Style, and reactivate the Adjust Lighting tool. In the Shadows style, the primary focus is the effect of the environment light and shadows, so the shadows are now present on the ground. Close the lighting tool again and select the both shadow style by clicking the icon or using the keyboard shortcut D. Now we're back to the default visual style and both environment and ambient shadows are rendered. Each of these realistic visual styles can be used as you build and even present your scene without having the significant impact on your computer's processing power that the ray tracing style will have.